Welcome to the Bayern View and welcome to this video. Now, first things in order. If you are really interested in this channel, subscribe. If you're interested in this video, like. And on top of that, if you really want to get informed, there's alarm bells, wherever the hell it may be, in, somewhere on YouTube on the channel. Press it if you want to be notified. Also, uh, the socials of the Barn View, TikTok, Instagram. If you want to get any follow-ups, follow the Barn View, Liam's channels. They're all over the place. And if you're also in, and his Twitter too. I think he has his Twitter, if I'm not mistaken. And also, if you're into my own stuff personally, I have a TikTok called Zer Talks. If you're interested in following that, link will be down in the description. Wait, why well, can I? Below. Yeah, I don't know why my fingers are weird. Yeah, there you go. Links in the description below. I don't know why my fingers, one's up and one's down, but it is what it is. Anyways, let's get to the video, yeah? Enough with my stupidity. Uh, yeah. We gonna be talking about our defend defensive situations. Uh, well, from uh, Christian Falk, I still, you know what? Now I've had enough. I am gonna, you know what I'm gonna do before I read this? Yeah, I am gonna make sure to see who is this from. Who is this guy? Toby Atchafel. Christopher. Uh, he so he works in build and yeah, he works in build. All right, cool. Uh, just to be sure, yeah. All right. Now that we got that out of the way, let me read it. Because, okay, it's from him and Christian Falk. I know who Christian Falk is. All right. Bayern's on report. So let's go. Bayern's priority in January is a defender that can play both at center back and a right back. Pavard type of player. I can't even lie. I actually would love to have a defender like that. Especially since both Kim and Mizrahi will be with their national teams in January. All right, well, now that I read that and I told you who reported what I can get out of the screen, this is my assessment to the situation. Yeah, Kim Min Jae will be out for the AFC Asian Cup, which if you guys didn't know, it's happening around January, February. My country, Saudi Arabia, is involved as well. It's hosted in, uh, what country is hosting it this year, actually? I actually don't know who's hosting it this year. I need to check. But anyways, besides that, uh, also Mizrawi for my second home country, Morocco. They're going for the African Cup of Nations. I can't believe I don't know who's hosting either tournament. I'm actually dumb. I need to check these things. Either way, they're going for their tournaments. They're all happening in January, February, respectively. And uh, yeah, they're going to be missing chunks of the season until they finish their competitions. And I'll, I'll say this. We're already missing Delicht. For some dumb reason, Thomas Tuchel keeps on subbing off Opomikano like midway through the second half. I don't know if it's because he wants Opomikano to be more fit and doesn't want him getting injured midway through the game. I don't know what it is, but I find it stupid personally just play him because we have no other defenders. But hopefully Delicht will be back by then. Hopefully he's fit by then, doesn't get injured again. And yeah, if Kim and Jay leaves, not going to hurt us that much. But... And in terms of right back, I mean, we have Limer. I don't rate Limer really, but it is what it is. There's Bunasar. I don't rate him at all. But you know what? I saw the game today against Heidenheim. He actually played pretty good. So I'll give him credit where it's due. But again, it's against Heidenheim. Uh, my point is, yeah, is that. Oh, and we have Guerrero come shift in, in a position. But the point I was going to make, I don't know why I'm, I'm kind of starting today. But I think. I would. I think getting a defender that's versatile is what we need. I was saying Chalaba because I felt like Chalaba can play center back. He can even play midfield at times, right back. I feel like he's the type of guy. But if not, there's also Bella Kachap, who I, I'm not mistaken. Is he in Southampton right now? He's German as well. Plays right back and center back. Yeah, there you go. So that's pretty interesting, you know, options right there. So, yeah, listen, I agree with the, the Bayern board. I think a defender that can be right back and center back is very essential. Because if we're going to go far, even by the time Kim Min-Jae and Mizrawi are back, 
I feel like it's essential to have squad depth, but also depth that are versatile enough to play more than one position. And if that's the case, I'm all in for it. I really am. So, yeah, that's really my conclusion to it all. Let me go know what you guys think in the comments. Uh, and as I said earlier, like, subscribe, alarm bells if you want to be notified, uh, the socials of the Bayern View all over. And... Um, if you're interested in my stuff, Zier Talks, link in the description below. And I guess that's it from me. If you want, you know, take care of yourself, be safe, and peace out, man.